And the focus on Sadio Mane in a rich vein of form and topping the scoring charts. Will he add more today on EA TV? And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world, Old Trafford in Manchester. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we have our stockings already prepared, full of footballing presents for you. Mane! Well, unable to direct it on the target, and a goal kick to come. And here's the team for Everton. Asmir Begovic is the goalkeeper. James Tarkovsky plays with Michael Keane in central defence. Abdoulaye Dukure plays alongside Idrissa Gay in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Marcus Rashford. A real opening now. And he's gone for power. So close to finding the net. Well, United's defensive record is second to none. And Stuart, that's official. Well, they press the ball at the right times and then drop off at the right times too, which is key to any good defensive structure. Their tactical understanding is absolutely brilliant, which is why they've conceded so few goals. Mane! And there it is! The opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Rashford. Christian Eriksen now. Rashford. And he might be through here. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top... class goalkeeper that's absolutely brilliant can someone get on the end of this not the best clearance really showing off his wide range of passing skills well timed tackle well that'll be a free kick Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. And news coming through from Elland Road. A goal has been scored there, Alex Scott. It's a goal for Chelsea. They're the first on the score sheet here with 17 minutes on the clock. Thanks, as always, to Alex Scott. Marcus Rashford. Rashford. Ericsson. Rashford! And a goal! Calls for celebrations again. Two in front. Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. 2-0 now, and back on the way. Eriksson. Mane. Not a great pass.
Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Yes, it's really going so well for them and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Oh, the threat is there. Money! Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Mane, it's there for him. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Played over and still dangerous. Rashford. Oh, and the flag goes up. Well, he needs to be more aware there. He didn't work hard enough to stay on side. Keen. Oh, he's through here. And flag raised. Offside. Well, that was always going to be offside. He just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer. Wasteful from United. Guevara. And a throw in here for United. Almost at half-time, and they're making home advantage count, I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. A decent effort, but the keeper read it all the way. with the ball confidently but they dealt with the threat posed well the counter chance looks very real could be there it is the goals keep coming no stopping them today well here it is again and it's all about the pace in transition they're so quick to get out from the back and when he gets onto it he holds off the challenge keeps his balance and makes good contact with the ball that's a top-class finish. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Really good attacking play. And he's made headway. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. He's in with a chance. Still can be dangerous. And problem solved for now. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Really vital interception. Well, the supporters think it's on. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Can he deliver it with accuracy? The clearance wasn't decisive. Mane. Surely. So there goes the half-time whistle. It's Manchester United on... And back underway. No sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response from Everton in the second? And they need to get tighter, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Opportunity it is. Is it going to be? Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Bruno Fernandes. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So they restart the game, and only one team in it. 
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV, and looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Manchester United facing Manchester City. Getting forward. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Corner kick played in. Well, nearly shaving the post with that header. No mistake by the keeper. Well, they've managed to get away with it in the end, Stuart. Yeah, he's recovered it well, but that was a really poor mistake to start with. And in with a real chance. Oh, he saved it. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. Playing it in. Not away completely. Idrissa Gay. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. All hands on deck. Mane! Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, full marks to him for that header. But the goalkeeper did his job. Well, another corner following on from the last one. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Rashford. Couldn't keep the ball. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Everton taking on Derek, Newcastle this could be United. A goal here. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. Oh, my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Can he find the right pass? A fine reading of the situation. Now potential danger. Just needs to stay calm. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and Rashford's finish gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. But well, I believe there's been a goal in the Liverpool match. Alex Scott has the details. Yeah, it's a third goal for Liverpool. It was a low-driven cross into a crowded Oh, area. forgive me, Alex. What an opportunity here. Oh, and it goes. Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. a one-sided game you just wonder how many more they could add well he might be expelled from the game and his day is done second yellow card Stuart well I have to say it was coming why was he not taken off earlier well lacking a bit of inspiration with that free kick attempt well lacking inspiration and lacking a bit of quality as well that's a really poor effort Your wife is for you. Thank you. and unfortunately we did have to cut alex off there just to confirm liverpool did score in that game and they are running away with it seemingly 3-0 in front veghorst oh you don't want to lose the ball in that position attacking football at its finest well here's the replay and he's got to clear his lines there he doesn't do that he has his pocket picked and he's been rightly punished poor defending perfectly positioned to take it away and that 
Sink to cross into the centre. And he's headed it in! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. They've lost it. Good pressure to regain possession. Marcel Zabitza. Just ten minutes to go. What a shocking pass, really. Right, an opportune moment for us to join Alex Scott because there's been a goal at Elland Road, Alex. It's a goal for Chelsea. They've extended their lead to three with just under ten minutes to go. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Bruno Fernandes. Zavica. Putting his body on the line. Now defenders having to cover up. Casimiro and now Rashford Rashford a goal here giving his team precisely what they were looking for now he deserves to celebrate it well as you can see he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace and then it's a decent finish that's a very good goal you have to say well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Orsolini. And oh, they've given him too much space. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. This is going to be a double substitution. Now sending it in. through here and a goal he's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form well here it is again and the pace in which they break forward is devastating it's so hard to defend against and when he gets onto it he decides to go for power it's a really emphatic finish which gives the keeper no chance and we're underway again. This game very much over as a contest. And that is the end of the game. It goes down as a United triumph. Some questions regarding the match. Thank you, that's all the questions we've got for you.
Thanks for waiting. We're now ready to take your questions. That's the end now. Thank you for your... It is a fixture not just for Mancunians, but for the entire football world. Manchester City and Manchester United will go at it today. Who will come out on top? Stay with us, you won't miss a minute of action right here on EA TV. All roads lead to Manchester today, and we're at the Etihad for a special derby. It is City versus United. Derek Ray here on the commentary position, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. Can't wait for this one, Stuart. Well, what a great environment to play football. Let's just hope we see two sides who want to win the game, rather than being too defensive. This should be a very good game between two excellent teams. And so the battle commences. 
And so they stop. And far from a smooth challenge. Now, will the referee produce a card? So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there he's not going to take any messing about here. And Edison has somehow kept it out. Who can they pick out? Jordi Alba. Zabica. Now Muda. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And a goal update to bring you from the Emirates Stadium. Alex Scott. It's a goal for Arsenal. The goalkeeper will be looking at himself on that one. He was totally out of position and it was an easy finish. They're the first on the score sheet here with six minutes played. It's been a really fast start to proceedings here, Derek. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. That was interesting to look at the table. And what can we say about these runaways, for want of a better word? Well, they're in a great position at the moment, as you mentioned. Oh, they Derek. might score here, Stuart. Nicely saved. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. Well, still an issue here. Superbly read and executed. Kevin De Bruyne. Silva. Good movement. Flag up, tight offside. And that was a very fine read. Oh, the threat is there. Being egged on by the crowd. And there it is! Joy for City! They strike first in the derby! And listen to the roar of the crowd! Unbelievable! And a goal to tell you about at St Mary's. Here's Alex Scott. It's a goal for Spurs. It's now one in 15 minutes. Sorry to play. jump in. It could be on for them here. Oh, there it is. A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted merely minutes. Well, here we can see it again. And he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. And apologies to Alex for having to cut her off. Just to confirm, Tottenham did score in that match. And their lead stands at 1-0 presently. Good tackle taken away. Phil Foden. Now with Silva. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Please go to the ticket office to meet Nathan. Thank you. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And a blunder by the keeper. Now, what can they produce on the flank? The delivery. Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. Byers. Well read to win possession back. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Bernardo Silva. Grealish just couldn't capitalise there Müller and space here on the flank Zabica Mane and it's two for him today a masterful performance the defenders unable to stop him
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and Mane's movement and penalty box awareness makes this finish look easy. That's a nice goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Grealish. Well, there it is. United haven't had as much of the ball, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got... Oh, hang on, Stuart, it's a chance! And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Kevin De Bruyne. Here's Alvarez. Given away by City. He's in with a chance. It's got to be. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, let's take another look at this pass from Mane. He has so much vision and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Now the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Grealish. Given away by City. What's he going to do here? Muda. A glorious chance. Well, it was down to whether or not he could beat the keeper, and that question has been answered. De Bruyne Not the pass he had in mind So two minutes to be added on at the end Bernardo Silva Good tackle Real chance Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. Splendid defending. Half time. That will... Back in business and no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between them in the first half. Will we see a response from City in the second? Possession lost. Will it happen for them? Mm. 
Mane. Is this the moment? Oh, good save. One terrific save after another. Well, he could give it away. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Kevin De Bruyne. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. Oh, big chance here, Derek. Well, the shot more than decent. It had power, just couldn't find the target. Well, as you can see, United have been really good going forward. They've created so many chances, and if they score again soon, it could become very embarrassing. And goal news to bring you from the Emirates. Let's join Alex Scott. It's a goal for Brentford. It's all even Stevens at 1-1 with 53 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Oh, great attacking play. Could be. And it goes. A three-goal cushion. And you truly sense it's a matter of how many. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. and it's a great finish he holds off the defender keeps his composure and finds the back of the net it's a marvellous goal Manchester Not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things 4-1 And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Well, we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. It's Manchester United taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great... Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. And Manchester City will go to their bench. And over from Ericsson. Terrific block there. Ericsson. Zabica. Is it going to be? Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there, but they do take it well, you have to say. A goal update to bring you in the Arsenal game. Alex Scott has all the news for us. It's another for Brentford. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 67 minutes played. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Very quick thinking there. Marcel Zabica. Byers. And they need to get tighter. Spot on with that tackle. So now a corner. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. I'm giving the ball away. Traore. The ball with Rodri. Grealish. On to De Bruyne. Easy save. A quarter of an hour remaining here. 
And with that, the attack fizzles out. George Byers. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Mares. And news of a goal at Craven Cottage. He's in behind. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. to our viewers for having to interrupt Alex just then. To clarify, Fulham have scored in that game and it's level now at one goal apiece. Well, when you can keep the ball like this, it's got to be really annoying for the opposition. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Mares. United finding space on the wing. And the cross into the middle. And that's the hat-trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and what about the finish? With such control and technique. That could have gone anywhere, but not with his skill. It's a great goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. And a change to the scoreline in the Fulham game. Alex Scott can tell us more. It's a second goal for Chelsea. They're now behind by one with 87 minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. George Byers. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Mane. At the back post and waiting is Thomas Müller. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And then what a strike. The lovely half volley. It's so difficult to keep these down. This is a very tidy finish. Mane. Christian Eriksen now. And there it is, the final whistle, a result to please Manchester United fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw. Uh, some questions regarding the match. Thank you.
Thank you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. That's all we have time for today.